Which, this is probably her specialty. Is I mean, it? I like to think so. Yeah. Texting is your specialty. She came out of the womb with a phone in her hand. She did. And I don't even have to look. Beautiful. So who's today's honored guest that needs some tender textual healing? His name is Adam. Adam, welcome to the show. Thanks for having me. Ooh, up, somebody bro? doesn't sound very excited. It sounds like you got a problem, Adam. <laughs> Tell us a little bit about the situation that you're in and how we can help heal you textually. Well, I really like this girl, and she's not getting back to me. Oh. That's cute. I think it's cute. Why is that cute? Because he really likes someone, and it's always fun to really like someone. Well, well, maybe you should know more about it. It could be a sibling, Brooke. It could be a dead person. You don't know. Who who is this person that you're affectionate for, Adam? So her name's Nicole. Okay. How'd you meet her? We met on a dating app. Oh! (laughs) Stop making fun of me. Have you guys gone out on a date? We went out on a date, yeah. How come you didn't try and do this for a second date update? I was just thinking that. Because normally that's what our listeners would do. Yeah. Well, just because I kind of had this, like, fear of, like, talking to her. It's oh. kind of left off pretty bad. So I prefer not to talk to her. I was hoping that maybe kind of good text that maybe you guys could help me out with. Oh, my okay. gosh. Yeah, Did you make uh, her mad or something? Why are you scared of her? I don't know if she's mad. I'm not sure what the situation is, to be honest. Huh. Things went pretty good, and... One thing that I do when I, like, meet a girl on, especially, like, dating apps, and I'm, I know it's going to sound weird to you guys, but I'll ask for, like, a reference or two. What? You say a yeah. reference? Like a job reference? Yeah. yeah I just kind of want to know what I'm getting into because, you know, there's so many weird people out there. I just... Um, <laughs> like, what are you... Uh, and yeah. asking for reference isn't weird? Yeah, <laughs> like, right. she agreed to this? Yeah, she did. Oh, and, wow. um... You know, I'm investing my time and possibly my future, and, wow. and she was okay with it. She gave me, like, her best friend, and she actually gave me her ex. Oh. I mean, that should be a red flag a little bit to you, that she still has <laughs> her ex's phone number. So, did you call them? Yeah, I was texting with them, actually, on the date. On the date? What? During, During the, date? the date? you're texting with Whoa. her ex and her BFF? Yeah. What? Oh, no. Did she know that? She actually did know because the reason why she gave me like her ex and stuff too is because she had nothing to hide. So I texted him and asked him, oh. you know, about her right in front of her. She didn't care. Oh, okay. This is so, I mean, you're just so nonchalant about it. Yeah. But I mean, <laughs> yeah. listen, I would think the same thing. I have nothing to hide. So yeah, text my friends. If that's going to get us the date, sure. Yeah, but but you're, you're already on the date. It kind of kills the momentum when you're at the <laughs> yeah. dinner table and you're paused to text totally. your ex. And when yes. you ask for references, is anyone ever going to give like someone who's going to talk smack about you? Like, <laughs> no, you know, like you're going to have, I'm going to tell them to give the best review possible. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, totally. So you texted her best friend and her ex-boyfriend during the date. What did they say? Pretty much all good things. I mean, it all checked out. The only kind of thing that I thought was odd was like, you know, the ex mentioned that she had like commitment issues. <laughs> what? Oh, oh. Well, at least he's not like, I Dude. still love her. It yeah. sounds like your date was an interview. It <laughs> like, does. Basically. It does. So when you got the text about her having commitment issues, did you address that? Absolutely. I mean, I, I asked her right away, and she didn't hide from it. She said there is a reason why she has commitment issues, and it was because she didn't want to commit to him. Oh, uh, <laughs> that's the issue. Good response. Wow. Yeah. Good. Did the rest of the date go okay after this, or was it super awkward? It wasn't any more, like, awkward than a first date normally is, I guess. I mean, it was it went pretty good, you know, I'd say. So why are you scared to talk to her? Why are we having to help you text her right uh. now? Well, I haven't heard from her, and the last text I sent her might have uh, made me look pretty bad. What? What'd you say? So she didn't respond to a couple of my text messages, so the last text I said was just like, why haven't you texted me back in all caps? Are you done talking to me? Oh, oh, bro. oh dude. you're a clinger. Yeah. <laughs> Seriously. It comes, Why would you it do? It comes off that way. Yeah. Especially after the date references. What do you want me to do? I mean, I we had a good date. It, we hit it off, and it's rude for her to just not even respond back to me. No, dude, you need to be cool, man. <laughs> yeah. She doesn't owe you anything. But he knows she has commitment issues, so he can <laughs> 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 Looky who was right. Am I right? Yeah. <laughs> committing to even a text back. What are you going to, I mean, maybe make a joke? Like, sorry to Kanye you or something? I'm like, what do you say? Mm-hmm. And that's actually kind of funny. Yeah, sorry to go Kanye on you. Like, I just really like you. I don't know if I want to say I went Kanye on you because then I don't want to think like I'm bipolar. <laughs> 
like, well, well, you already look it. So. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> no girl, no girl is attracted to that Too intense. Many texts. Yeah. Why don't you text her something like, "Good morning, I hope you're having a good day," all caps, and then say, "Oh no, is my caps lock still stuck?" Yes. Like, it's oh, so passive though. Yeah. I don't know. I do like that more than the first suggestion okay. though. Okay, well maybe some or kind of joke. What do you guys think? You text back, oh my god, I'm so embarrassed. That was meant for my mom. <laughs> <laughs> That's kind of funny too. Yeah. I mean, I think you try and put an apology in there and you say sorry about that. Like that was not meant for you. I meant to text it to somebody I else. Ex-boyfriend. That was yeah. for your ex-boyfriend. <laughs> right. And then <laughs> All right, so just apologize and... And then you go to ask her a question because, I mean, you're not giving her a question. You're not giving her a reason to respond. Mm -hmm. So you need to just say, like, what are you doing next Thursday? Like, try to make a date. Okay. Sorry about that. That was not meant for you. That was for my brother. (laughs) There you go. Okay. Are you free tonight for dinner? Oh, okay. Okay. There you go. Yeah. yeah. And put a smiley face, like winky smiley face, so, to show that you're still fun and mm-hmm. not psycho. Yeah. Fork mm-hmm. and knife. Uh huh. Whatever you want to do. Sushi. I mean, they can go buck wild with the food emojis. Yeah. <laughs> Just don't use that, like, head exploding emoji, because I feel like that's kind of, <laughs> kind of what you did last time. How's that, Adam? Are you texting that? Yeah, I just sent it. I said, sorry, that was meant for my brother. Dinner tonight. And I did a smiley face emoji, but nothing else. I don't want to get too crazy with the emoji. Oh, yeah. Okay. okay. Yeah. All right. we'll, Still sounds a good yeah, we'll save sex. We'll save all the emojis for the next few texts that we do. Okay, <laughs> we're going to play a song, come back, and hopefully Nicole has responded. Okay. All right, hold on. If you're just joining us, welcome. But before you're allowed to listen, we will need two references from everyone listening. <laughs> Don't want any weirdos on this morning show. Yeah, anyway, safe. Exactly. Uh-huh. Anyway, if you're just tuning in, one of our listeners, Adam, emailed us because he went out with a woman named Nicole, and he asked her to provide two references during their date. But she did it. That's so so crazy to me. Like she was game. Yeah. Which means she liked him. Yeah. And, and apparently the references went okay. Things went well. But now afterwards she's not responding. And normally in a situation like this, we'd handle it through a second date update. Yeah. But Adam says he feels like talking to Nicole in person would be too weird too awkward so he literally said he's like kind of scared of her yeah (laughs) after he sent his aggressive text about why she wasn't getting a hold of him right she wasn't responding and so adam said what are you ignoring me now or something like that in all caps and so he'd rather just handle the rest of this over text messages understand it's a smart move i think so yeah you know adam we're giving you a little bit of a hard time about it but i can understand in these awkward situations it's easier to just do it without speaking yeah, for sure. And, like, what are you going to do? After an all-caps text, you're going to call her eight times and she doesn't answer? Like, <laughs> yeah. that's not going to look real good either. So right? the last thing that Adam texted was basically a made-up excuse saying that that last text message was meant to go to his brother mm-hmm. and he's sorry about that. He really had a good time with her and would like to go out again tonight. Yeah. yeah. Now, has she responded to that text message, Adam? Yes. She did. Ooh, okay. That didn't sound positive. Yeah, the tone of your voice was a little strange. What did she say? She said, no thanks, not interested. Okay. Oh, all right. Well, that ends this. Okay. So all right. Good talking to you. Thanks for emailing yeah, us. Yeah, you got the response. That's a really cold response, too. Mm. Yeah, I just don't know why she's I Like, what would she be mad about? Like, the texting her ex, the references thing, or, like, the text I sent her that was in caps? Like, I just... Yeah. I mean, those are I mean, good candidates for sure. But Yeah, I mean, maybe she thinks that the brother thing is a joke. Do you want to stick with this lie? Do we want to double down on it, essentially, and say, yeah, no, like, really, that's a good I idea. hate lying. But that's just, I mean, yeah, I mean, we're down this road already. Yeah, we've already gone down this path, so. I would do that. She's saying she's not interested, so it's got to be about the brother thing, you know? Well, okay. ask her. I mean, that's what we're saying. Ask her. I think you you just doubled down like you said. Like, no, I'm being serious. That text message really was for my brother. And then you can say something nice to her, like complimentary. Like, I really like you. I thought we had fun. Like, mm-hmm. please let me know what's going on. That's pretty good. Okay. And it sounds calm. That's the vibe we're trying to give, Adam. Yeah. Maybe yeah. should we add like a puppy dog eyes emoji? You know, like No, that's a no. little it's a little needy. Okay. Yeah. I, I, I think we're done the with time. the emojis yeah. at this point. Well, you're very single. Wow. Yeah. So no, I'm serious. That was really a text from my brother. I really want to see you again. I had a good time. 
I, yeah. I thought we had fun. Can you please tell me what's going on? Okay. All right. I sent it. Okay. Okay. And then crying yeah. emoji. Why? Yeah. Why? Yeah. Why? <laughs> I mean, Alexis, you're single 22-year-old girl. In your opinion, do you think Adam has a shot here or is he done? I think he's got to go all in on the lie. You got to really convince him. Oh, <laughs> we're not lying happened. hard enough. Mm. Or say you were drunk. Always good. Oh, <laughs> oh we didn't think. Oh, uh, the drunk yeah. defense. Yeah, sorry, I was drunk. Oh, I didn't okay. know how to turn a caps lock off. <laughs> 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 it's, I think but it's it's believable for sure. We love sent me. The text, though, so now we have to prepare. Stick with what the if, you're going with. What yeah. if she comes back at us and is like, still nope? Like, how would she change her mind? I don't know. We have to figure that out. Has she responded to you yet, Adam? Well, she's typing because I see the dot. <gasps> okay. Oh, it's not that means good... it's not going to be a quick response. Yeah, that's <laughs> not that, a good sign. Or she's typing, deleting, typing, deleting, typing, deleting. Yeah, which is also not a good sign. Yeah, <laughs> it means she has a lot of bad things to say <laughs> and is trying to figure out the right way to say them. Uh oh. What? She just sent it in. Okay. Um, Tell us. What is it? Well, yeah. What? What happened? <laughs> she said because I asked. For references from her, she did the same to me. Okay. <laughs> but she never Wait, asked you. Did she ask you for references? No, she didn't. Hold on, hold on, hold on. She just sent me something. Oh my god. What does what? it say? Uh, she went on my Facebook and she messaged people. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Dang, Dude, I mean, you can't get mad. You did this to yourself. You're the one that asked for references in the beginning. Well, not really, because I didn't say it was okay. And <laughs> she gave me the references, so she got to choose who I reached out oh, to. Oh, yeah. That's uh, not the point, though. It's pretty well no, played you, on her part. <laughs> you opened the door, dude. Yeah. It's like Pandora's box, right? Yeah, kind of. Uh, do you have people on your Facebook that you're friends with that you would really not like to be referring you? Yeah, the person she mentioned, Tammy, my ex, <gasps> she reached out to, and uh -oh. this is unreal. Wait, did she say what Tammy said? Yeah. Yeah, uh, pretty sure, because she's still typing something, because oh. there's still more dots oh. going. Okay. Uh -oh. Well, maybe it's not bad news. Maybe it's a good thing. Uh -huh. Maybe Tammy is glowing reviews about no. you and wants to she, reunite. She already said, no thanks, not interested. Because Tammy's <laughs> so, interested. Tammy oh wants to get back God. together now. I does like your optimism. ex, wait, does your ex hate you, Adam? Yeah, we're not on a good terms at all. <laughs> oh, did, you, Adam. did you cheat on her or something, dude? You Is bad boy. Something bad? I didn't cheat on her, but she's, hold on. There's another text. Oh, what does it say? <laughs> Having to wait and read this must be so Oh, my awful. God. I, it's awful for me waiting to hear what the drama is. I want to know. <laughs> Angry girls texting is scary, too. Oh, yeah, yeah, that's a great point. This is bullshit. This isn't even a, like a thing to... Oh, what? what? What did she say to you? She said that I kiss all my family members on the mouth. Oh. <laughs> and that's a nose hair problem. <laughs> Wow. Oh, my God. Oh, it's Dude. funny because it's like, it's weird it's enough. It's not that bad. It's not that what? bad, is, but is, it's I weird know. enough. I kiss all my family on the mouth. Okay, I don't think that's is, a weird you know, what? You just, well, You're okay. from Idaho, Brooke. It's very normal over there. I kiss everybody on the mouth. That's what I think is no. going okay. on. Everyone's no one. No. I'm sorry. No. I don't think it's well, a big well, deal. We don't even know if that's the truth. Adam, is that true? Do you really do that with your family? It's a safe place, Adam. You could tell us because it's not a big deal. <laughs> Brooke is begging for him to admit it. It's not a big deal. So you do. Uh, yeah, I mean, everybody. It's normal. If you, yeah, uh, you okay, can yeah. stop being normal. No. Okay, okay both you, you go know. to any other country, people are kissing left exactly. and right. It doesn't matter. <laughs> what are fine. you talking about? It's fine. Okay, well, uh, she just sent another one. So, oh. I mean, ne never mind. Never mind what? <laughs> What'd she say? You have to tell us. No, nah, I mean... I'm not gonna read anything else. I I think I'm I think I'm good. No, oh, come no. On. read it. I'm I, I'm sorry for judging you out the kissing your your dad thing. Like that was rude of me. It's not that. It's the last thing she just said about me is pretty bad, and and it is actually uh, true. So I I just would rather not. Oh, oh. dude, you can't bring oh, well, us to well. this point, Adam, and then not share everything. Wait. I yeah. mean, come on, you're in the company of terrible people. So you're fine. You do more than just kiss your family. <laughs> Shut up, Jeff. One, what could it? Does. What could it be? It really doesn't matter because there really is no coming back from this. She knows like way too much. I'm probably gonna have to block her. What? Oh. what? That bad? Oh. 
Whoa. She just knows too much. I just, I don't even want to, like, deal with her now. Are you, like, what? wanted for some heinous crime yeah. or something? And that's why you have to protect your identity? It's not that. It's just... I'm not technically allowed, like, within, like, a mile of the zoo within, you know, at the city. The zoo? <laughs> what? I'm not allowed on the zoo premises or... Or within a mile, mile of the zoo? Dude, are you kissing the penguins? Well, it's it's kind of a, an incident that... It just it was in the paper and everything, and I'm just I'm not allowed to really talk. I don't I don't want to talk about it. Oh my god, I am so Google searching Adam Zoo right now. Yeah, <laughs> oh my god, I hope you try to steal a tortoise or something. Yeah. I don't know, man. I just um I think I just need to learn my lessons here and provide my own references moving forward. Oh, yeah. You're Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. Use your mom as a reference. He's a great kisser. <laughs> <laughs> Moving 92.5.